So good morning, everybody, and thank you for uh, coming to listen to me on this uh, cold morning. Uh, I'm not going to save the world, but we are uh, trying to make your life uh, slightly better and uh, tastier. My name is Shai Marcus, I'm the CEO of uh, Inolog, and we are in the winemaking business. So making wine is an ancient art. It stayed pretty much the same for the past uh, several thousand years. But introduction of machinery and automation made this art a very large global industry, highly competitive, and the competition is driven mostly by product quality. What we uh, propose uh, to, what we cl claim to provide is a way for the enologists and the wineries to improve their products by better control of the fermentation process. This way they can increase their sale and profits and we can also uh, offer a way to somehow reduce the workload of the professional staff during the, the harvest season. Quality of wine is determined mostly by the quality of grapes. So you can make uh, very bad wine from excellent grapes, but we cannot make excellent wine from very uh, low quality grapes. The second uh, most important factor is the ability of the winemaker to control the winemaking process. I'll make a general comment that in a boutique winery, which we see an example here, the quality of the product is better than industrial large wineries. And this is because the enologist, the winemaker in, in a boutique winery, has the attention and the time to uh, monitor all the tanks he has, because he has very few. And in large wineries, it's very, very difficult to attend all the uh, tanks during the, the process. And, correct errors or control the process during uh, the fermentation. This is a video taken uh, during our uh, uh, prototype testing. This is our system, I'm sorry, of the, of the poor lighting. We have a robotic arm going on a rail uh, above the, the wine tanks and penetrating the tanks, you can see in a second, the arm is penetrating the tanks. In the arm, there are state-of-the-art sensors that can measure many parameters inside the fermenting wine. Here you see the uh, picture from the inside. We can also perform what is called punch down, which is the breaking of the uh, pills cap and mixing it uh, with the liquid to uh, maximize the extraction of the uh, aroma and taste and color materials from the pills. In consultation with uh, winemakers from uh, different sizes, uh, uh, different winery sizes, we designed our, our system so it will be flexible and modular. The winemaker has a control to use whatever features of the system they want. We can provide real-time monitoring as well as uh, intervention and, and control of the peripheral system of all the winery and the, and the winemaker can control which level of automation they want to see. We also collect the data we, we uh, read from the wines and create a database that as we provide more information into the database during the, the use, it, be, it is becoming more and more accurate and better. So in the years since we started operation, we, ha we are already had our first prototype. As you saw, we, we conducted a very successful alpha testing in an experimental winery that we built. Um, and we produced uh, about 2,000 liters of uh, very good wine to prove that uh, the, the concept works. Now we are uh, developing our uh, beta, uh, beta prototype and we plan to test it in the next uh, harvest season in the summer. Um, we are expecting to launch the product in 2018. We're currently raising uh, a round of investment in order to help us uh, complete the development and maybe shorten the time to market. We are already in discussion with uh, strategic partners uh, that will help us uh, market our uh, uh, system worldwide. A few words about the team. We have uh, uh, a team that is a combination of uh, professionals coming from academia, commercial winemaking, engineering and business development. So although it's uh, very early in the morning, this is uh, what we are want to do and I will be available after the session for uh, more details. So basically, is your technology looking to replace the classical vintner, the winemaker, or where in the process are you, uh, are you working vis-a-vis uh, -vis the winemaker? God forbid we won't replace the winemaker, we, we never do that. The winemaker is the artist, he's the chef of, of making wine, 
Um, we are just providing a tool to help the winemaker control the process. It's most important in the, in the large wineries, they cannot attend all the tanks. They sometimes lose uh, quality, they lose wine that was uh, uh, targeted to the higher price. Uh, group and, and they sell it in lower price and lose a lot of money because they, they, they missed something. Something went bad during the process and they didn't catch it on time. So this is what we produce them. For those who want, we can also provide a way to automatically uh, do the, the process, but still the winemaker will be in full control.